Well, James, so much went on in that game. It, it seems difficult to know where to start. It was sensational entertainment. Is that the best performance since you took over as manager? Um, well, I, th I think the best performance uh, with ten men probably. It, 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 it out, maybe outweighs the the Berry performance a few weeks ago, but I think with eleven men, probably uh, you know Scunthorpe is our, our best performance of the season away. Um, but you know what can you say? The the desire and commitment that the lads shown as their as their manager and you know as 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 a lot of their friends. I, I said I'm very proud today to be to be involved and to be in in charge of them. And uh, ever since we I I I came in and took the job. They were the reason I took it, and today uh, is is a a day which you know makes me feel happy that I did. Uh, not that any other day doesn't, but you know it's sort of a little bit extra special. And um, I just I love them. I love them. The class, and I, I just love working with them. Uh, and you know they put themselves on the line. You've got people throwing themselves in front of tackles, uh, players. Selflessly running, so so that the, the team doesn't concede, and and really just lay, you know laying the the cards on the table and, and showing me everything that that I would want from them, and uh, there's a there's a special atmosphere in there, you know to 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 be defeated in two games and then come back and put a performance in like that, it um it says to everybody else out there the the things that I already know about the lads, and. Um, the potential in there is 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 very good, and uh, couple that with the spirit and and determination they showed today, then you've got you've got a good side. We are a very good side if we do things right at the right times, and uh, we've shown that on a number of occasions this year. Uh, if we, if we don't do the right things at the right times, you know we we can we can struggle. But you know I suppose that's the same for any team. But they give me everything. Uh, they've got a great great training. Uh, Attitude towards training, and uh, they've got obviously a great attitude towards games. And for for them to to put a performance in like that when they're down to ten men, even even with ten men, I thought maybe you know we could have gone gone on and got a few more had had Peter, Peter not got sent off. So it might have been a a blessing for them. But the, the their side is full of quality players, and uh, I think they they played it exactly right. How 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 you would try and get at an advantage against ten men is is keep switching the play, try and tie the players out and get the ball in the box, and that's what they did. But they they met up against the uh, the resilience of of my boys, and you know to a man, everybody, even the substitutes that came on and, and ran selflessly. You know, Webbs, I've had to take him off at half time, unfortunately for him. But I think we, you know, we, we got it spot on, and uh, the lads had to dig in, and, and it's all all about your players, and it's all about them boys in there. This time last year, Lee Molyneux scored nine goals in a dozen games, and you stayed up. Hat trick for him today he was virtually unplayable, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, I mean he's he's uh, he's probably the major reason why we did stay up last year. Uh, you're right, and uh, he, he got his he got his move, and then for one reason or another, whatever that reason was, it's not quite worked out for him at Crew. But he's come back in in here. He's come back into an environment where he, he's comfortable, and uh, he's playing with a smile on his face. He's always he's always receptive to information and wants to learn, and uh, you know it's he deserves it. And I think he the uh, his hat trick sort of uh, epitomises the spirit and the performance that that everybody in there has put into there. Blow to lose Peter Murphy, of course. Any complaints about the, the two bookings as it turned out to be? Well, the, fir the first one's a silly one. I mean. You know, you tell players to stand over the ball, but you don't expect the opposition players to kick the ball at them uh, and get them booked. Uh, and then the second one, I thought he's he's won the ball. Um, you know, you can't tell your players not to tackle and, and try and win the football because the possession possessions. You know, it's not. I was going to say nine tenths of the law then, but it's probably nine tenths of the game, isn't it? You try and win the ball back, and and he's won the ball. And I thought it was a, a good tackle, but obviously he's he's. His momentum has, has followed through on on, uh, on, Gar on Dan Gardner there, and, and hopefully he's okay. I know Peter's been in to see him uh, to make sure he's all right, because at the end of the day, you, you never want to purposely injure someone, and, uh, and I don't think any any of my players would. Um, but it's a sending off; it's happened, and and the lads have put in a, a great performance to back you know back it up with ten men. Quite a debut for Adam Buxton as well. Talk about in at the deep end. Yeah, I think I don't think Adam's played that much football, but you know you you could see he's, he's very very accomplished on the ball and, and he's added that extra 
extra bit of composure in there. Um, just, <laughs> I just said to him there, he's getting a rub on his calves. I said, somebody will, it'll feel like somebody's poured concrete in them tomorrow morning, so he better get a long rub on him. But, you know, it's, it's about working on his fitness, but his, his quality is undeniable. Last thing, first home win of the year, first home win since November, I think. Can this be the catalyst to kick you on now towards the end of the season? Well, I think, I think, I knew, you know, you, there's a dogged determination about us and, uh, you know, we're hard to beat. Uh, which was, which is, uh, you know, in, in contrast to what we was like in the at the start of the season, and I, I think it's um, it's hopefully, a, you know, like you say, a, a stepping stone to, to getting more points, and I think maybe maybe more than 50 points is going to be the target this year because the league is so tight, as you know, um, and even even the win today with the results going as they are, we don't really we don't move, do we? So. It's a good job we did win, um, but uh, no, we'll, we'll we'll keep working and we'll keep trying to trying to produce performances that that see us getting points.